uh, rushing down. So I guess what's going to come down to is again how well can uh, Oracle keep HLP out? Yeah, and on the flip side, how well can HLP find some of these openings? Oracle loves to go for some of these patterns on pressure, some of the missile usage, some of the more fall, but if he can get in, if he can stop these from even occurring before these zone setups can even get started, that's going to be a stick of the game. One thing I'm glad already, oh dang, he's getting up aired forever. I was gonna say, I was, I'm glad to see uh, Oracle is not afraid to use these up air streams. I actually think Samus' up air isn't so bad. That's like a combo with tool anyway. Narrowly missing with the shot put. Covering the roll as well. Yeah, um, that shot put actually is really underrated, man. It's crazy. We saw how effective it was against K9s. Of course, Samus can bury her recovery up a tiny bit more through the use of the jump and the more ball her thought shifting, but it's still very effective. Orko's going for a lot of screw attacks. At first, I thought he was just doing them out of shield, but then he's just throwing them out sometimes. But uh, yeah, the, uh, Morph Ball is good even if it doesn't hit because it pretty much forces them to go in a way that you want you want them to to get an easier uh, punish. Like they want to go like a certain arc below to a blocking hit by it, and then you just cover that with something else. Special the shield's gonna be a speed and pulled out full grab from Oracle. <laughs> that was silly shield situation there. <laughs> it's like waiting each other's shield or who's gonna attack first. And no one does anything. She just rolls away. Nice. Is that that has to be a down B, right? That's up stuff. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's up B. He's not using the uh, the up B that I'm used to seeing. Yeah, the down B is the one where he lands on his head. If this is the me, I think it is. Yeah, I didn't even see the uh, colors or sorry, the numbers I attached to this game. Oh my goodness. But right now, yeah, H O B does not look like he's pressured at all, honestly. Oh my goodness. That move is, is that move just safe? But I've rarely seen him get punished for doing that. Probably he's reacting the way it crosses you off or not, but I'm not quite sure if it would be safe the way you've seen him get punished so far. Oh my goodness, they both hold shield for way too long. Yeah, we're gonna try to make something happy here. Lice trying to get some shield set up there, but uh, yeah, Angel B's not making it easier at all. Even on stay on the platform throwing up the shot play is really good for him. Like it just covers so much space on the ledge as well. That's not gonna kill, but again, you send him in a really poor spot. HLB loves to use that up special out of shield and sort of that region right next to the platform where it's kind of ambiguous whether you're landing on the stage or on the platform itself. Okay, finally, catching the jump with the forward air. Still though, really, really close to dying. Even with a heavy carry like Samus, and uh, HLB isn't doing anything super risky. He's playing around the projectile really intelligently, picking the hits that he can. And uh, if anything, he's just like, all right, I have all the time in the world to just you know, take this shot. I don't have to do anything crazy. But there's the other special again. I'm not sure what the exact name of that move is. I know all the me like moves have certain names. I mean, it's been three and a half minutes and he's only taken 9% on his yeah. second stock here. Yeah, he's playing the long game for sure. Like, it's, it's always interesting to see a zoning character get like kind of you know zoned out themselves like how do they deal with it you know that was a hot combo though oh my goodness fishing there with the beat Ooh, combo landing. that move is actually incredibly strong by the way yeah side if, special killing at 91 there yeah it's just so powerful it, it's a lot more powerful than you'd imagine and with the angle it sends you it's very difficult to DI as yeah. well yeah i like that you saved that for like the clutch situation to take the stock so yeah, I already got that, that huge combo, aiming with the, uh, the up B. Yeah, just a battle of the up B out of shield here. Are we seeing an HLB switch to another? Oh, what? Interesting. This is, in, like, this is interesting only because it's a projectile character versus DK. Like, most DKs hate playing the matchup like this. But we are on town and city, so now I can see why he picked DK. Got a glimpse of what this character can do in Marco Saga, and you know, so many people saying, "Oh, this character is horrible matchup against the likes of Sonic," and we just saw a couple of DKs embody them in that matchup. Can the same magic be worked here? I mean, it's possible. He has the perfect stage for it. Oh my goodness, these back airs. Oh my, is he gone? Oh, oh my god. god, he's alive, but for how long, dude? He took so much percent off stage. Four to five in a row. Bro, he, just, he just died to it. <laughs> he just back aired his whole life away. 
HLB making DK look like a wonderful character at the moment. Becker's probably his best move, I'll be honest. This is at least his best area. Oh my goodness. Easy snipe. It's like no percent whatsoever. DK is way too big. Yeah, just got picked out of the air with that charge shot. Interesting enough, uh, so I'm not, if you guys see uh, HLB take advantage of the platforms when he gets a grab, I keep expecting him to just jump, carry him to the platform and like up throw up there to the top. Yeah, it's strange. Sand is, of course, a very heavy character, so the ding dong percent is a lot larger. The window is a tiny bit smaller and it starts a lot later than other characters, but when you have that tri flat laid out, the inverted pyramid there, it might sort of work. Yeah. Oh, okay. That new up B that he got is actually so strong. I killed people like at the edge at like 90. Or, so I wonder if we'll see it. I feel like HLB is saving it much like he did the side special last game for a moment where he really needs it, but who knows? It's it's potent for sure. Oh, that's unfortunate. Both of his up airs missed, and like one of the up airs even looked like it should have connected. Because it was like right on his body. Tiny blind spot there, but that proved to be all the difference in the round. Alright, how does uh how does he make this comeback happen? He's kinda getting bullied by all these projectiles now. Like the this is like the struggle of DK versus owners. He's like a big body, so he's gonna get hit by so many different projectiles. And uh I don't know. I feel like his kill options are very ter telegraphed in this situation. Or perhaps. I mean, besides grab, I fail to see what he can really get here without the platforms present. Alright. Nice. All the way to the corner. Can you get this punish though? Oh, he sends him out. That's good for him. You get another chance. Oh, okay. So he'll get the stock. It's 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 worth it's worth to take that much percent. He's still DK. He can live uh, longer than you would expect. You see, even that back here with bad DI, he's still alive. Yeah, across the stage. Oh, we'll come to jump. Yeah, I'll do it. He did like the classic bait of uh, put the bomb at the ledge to so make you feel like you have to jump over it. And he just immediately for there. Yeah, when you're already at 118, 120, even just the minor percent that Morphal adds on, you narrow, you pretty much want to avoid it at all costs, and that should force the jump from HLB. Excellent recognition from Oracle. All right, good stuff, Oracle taking the game, showing that you can't go your uh, random secondaries and try to cheese me out in town, which he didn't even abuse the platforms with, so I, I don't know if he's, yeah, he's, he's switching back. <laughs> There's no reason for him to stay. Certainly not. It is the B Brawler making his reappearance. a return to the same stage town and city event for game three. Let's see how Oracle utilizes this stage in this matchup because he did lose on PS2 uh, before with uh, the Samus versus um, B Brawler. Oh no, okay, we're making I thought that would lead to a horrible SD there with the like, tether not snapping the ledge. Yeah, I can see how both characters use up the out of shield differently when no platforms are present because there isn't that ambiguity. You have to go directly down to the stage if you win. Something though I just noticed, like Samus is very easy to combo, so I don't know, it doesn't seem no, like it's a big deal for HLB once he puts Samus in a jail situation. Even with like the more ball mix up that you can see to land, HLB doesn't care that much. He can still apply a lot of pressure there. Yeah, Samus is a very tall character model and in the middle of tumble animations when she's not more ball, she sort of sticks her limbs out and Hit on yeah, he's barely avoiding these uh, these shot puts, but still, again, he's using them in a way that he doesn't want to necessarily hit them, but he just wants to put them in a, a position where if they try to avoid it, they'll be an easier spot to get caught by something. I like could use the side platform to just bounce it on top of so that Oracle really couldn't get a sense of the angle they were traveling. Yeah. Yeah, I should research more on, on B Brawler. It's like all the different combinations you can do with the characters. I wonder if there's just like a certain combination that like they can consider the best or they can just kind of like do whatever one you want. I mean, as far as I know, there's really no consensus as to what's the best. I know that there's, you know, most people will say, ah, oh, the shot puts clearly the best neutral special, but what other specials do you sort of use it in oh tandem with? 
So I'm Oracle sure just Oracle like spooked, got spooked by doing something risky and thought HLB was gonna immediately try to run up and hit him. So he just like panic screw attack, but then he didn't pay attention to the ledge and just like SD for no reason. That's like his habit of a screw attack kind of biting him in the butt track, you know. Still, he can uh, you know do this without taking too much percent. Oh, he's gotta play really carefully. Find that opening. It's uh, HLB. It's not necessarily working out right now. He's getting hit by too many things. Oh man, the shot put on top of that. Oh, double shot put. Dang, that one was so strong. And that was such amazing recognition on when that stage transition was happening from HLB. You can tell that the platforms are going to turn out because it's four and a half seconds after the background stops moving. HLB landed on the side platform after the shot put connected, knowing that he was brave enough and knowing that he had calculated the risk well. That was actually really good. And suddenly, this comeback looks harder and harder for Oracle here. Like, look, just the way that HLB is playing, it's, it's not really doing anything super risky. It's just getting harder for the, the kill, but look at that down there is going to be untakeable, so he can secure his stock finally, but he, again, he's going to have to put in a lot of work, and HLB is not going to make it uh, free for him at all. Yeah. Yeah. He's, uh, he's, I like that he juke to the ledge there, but still, these like pay screw attacks. Oh, force smash! Yeah, he's super dead. That move is actually incredibly strong. It's one of like the strongest force smashes in the entire game. It's just like the hitbox is only active for like one frame though, so like that's why you don't see it that much. But when you do like something really punishable like that, it's uh, really easy for uh, me brawler to get that force match to connect. So uh, good stuff to HLB moving on still. You got that big win on K9. I know he was probably supposed to play Nico here, but we'll take those. Yeah, certainly. He'll be advancing either way. And I love that he just saved that Route 1 kill option for the end the same way he did with Side Special in mm -hmm. Game 1. Yeah. Did not force the issue.